and his mother-in-law. One day, he was lying in his tent. When he heard a cry from his wife, he jumped up to see mama-in-law shaking her fist at the huge lion who was standing five feet away from her, ready to move. Do something, pleaded his wife in alarm. Why should I? That lion got himself into this mess. Let him get himself out of it. Yes. So beautiful. Many jokes like this and it's that also many recipes and many tea times and many things to read. The world is to be treated. The world is to be treated as a stepping place not as a stopping place, use it as a bridge to God. Take care to get what you like, or you will be forced to like what you get. Thank you all, from A to Z. Life is always full of broken places, but there are those who become stronger at the cracks. It's a beautiful newsletter. A young farmer wishes to marry a beautiful girl with a tractor. Please send photo of the tractor. Yes. Everybody eats, but very few know how to eat. If we eat wrongly, no doctor can cure us. If we eat rightly, no doctor is needed. Beautiful. Yes, it's amazing. Every word, every word, every word. If you want happiness for an hour, take a nap. If you want happiness for a day, go fishing. If you want happiness for a month, get married. If you want happiness for a year, inherit a fortune. If you want happiness for a lifetime, help someone else. It's this one, yes. It is a healing home for body, mind, and spirit. And an educational center to help us know more about our body and self and our world in life. Many people are unreasonable, illogical and self-centered. Have the courage to love them anyway. If you do good, people may accuse you of naive and selfish motives. Have the courage to do good anyway. If you are successful, you may win false friends and true enemies. Have the courage to succeed anyway. The good you do today may be forgotten tomorrow. Have the courage to do good anyway. Honesty and transparency make you vulnerable. Have the courage to be honest and transparent anyway. What you spend years building may be destroyed overnight. Have the courage to build anyway. People who really want help may attack you if you help them. Have the courage to help them anyway. Give the world the best you have and you may get hurt. Have the courage to give the world your best anyway. The world, if full of conflict, have the courage to choose peace anyway. So whoever loves you, loves you for your pocket, for your profit, love them anyway. So this is what I was doing at the summer center. And so they invited me. They said, there is something. There is a big conference and you have to come. And I went there. So this lady, I forgot her name, but she was from, originally from the Arab world. She used to come to Salamsa, to summer center. And there was many pictures in the summer center, Salom, Salam, Shalom, and you know, from Islam and Sufism and Buddhism and people, they come and they say, what's your religion? The religiousness of the heart. I have no religion, no traditions, no logics, no law, but love is the way. All the books, all the religions are one. Be yourself. So I went there and she was talking to people that this big uh, celebration is for Maryam Noor. People came from over, all over the country and the Arab world. Oh my God, is this for me? Yes, she said. S speak. At that time, 
I was going to tell them about what's going on in the Arab world, you know, and why the Jewish people doing this with the Arabs. And on my going to the platform, a woman put some money in my pocket, a few dollars. She said, I'm a single mother. I'm a Jewish. Please spend this money in Lebanon, in the south of Lebanon. They were like three, four dollars. And she said to forgive my family, my parents in Israel. I said, oh my God, I have to love everyone. No more, you are a Jew, and I am a Christian, and I am from this land, you are from this land. We are all universal consciousness. I said, okay. And she said, you have the platform, and you are here to speak. So, people came from all over the country with all the flags, all the Native Americans, and the Lebanese one, and the S covered me with the Lebanese flag, and I said, we are not the tag, I'm not the flag, we are beyond any boundaries. And I told them this story. Daddy came home and little John said, I want to play with you. And Daddy was reading the newspaper and, and he saw the map of the planet and he said, okay, fix this map. And Johnny went and he said, he won't come back. And Johnny came back with the map fixed. How did you do it? He said, Dad, I could not fix it, so many lines. But I turned one piece and I saw the face of a man. So I fixed the man. And this is how the planet was fixed. So all the natives, they said, Mariam, this is what you are here for. To fix all the flags into one tag. That I'm not a woman. I'm not a man, I'm not American, or neither Christian, nor an Arab, nor don't belong to this planet, but universal consciousness. And the people, they started coming to my place, talking with the animals, and they said, yes, come home. And all these Native Americans. They said, yes, I saw once that I was an Indian, Native American too. When you do rebirthing or out of body experience and you go backward, like I'm not Lebanese, I'm not in this body, you go beyond and beyond and beyond. And it's all in this moment, no more to go for future or past. The past is a history, the future is a mystery. Now is the only time. Somebody wrote, God is nowhere. And literally, Sally came and said, God, God is, is nowhere, is a big word. Now dash here. God is now here or nowhere else. So I stopped being with this native treasure. And with the native treasure, I learned so much. And I'm still learning that I know nothing. Famous people. So-called famous, they wanted to be the president, and I said, no, I don't want to be a president, I don't want to be a famous, fame is form, but I want to be with my friends, so friends, and this is where I go when I go to the States, we live in a cottage, and this is what we do. I still have friends there, we live in cottages. And we live with people that are not only from this.